Welcome back. <laughs> that was a, we have yet to find a good way. No, I like that. Suggest me a way, God. I don't like that at all. I like the, the auctioneer way of, of, <laughs> of opening the episode. Lonely. Yeah, this is episode, I think, 75. Uh, um, yeah. Otherwise yeah. known as the Christ year. The Christ yes. year, yeah. Christ was famously 75 when he passed away. He was. He also he died in 1975. Mm-hmm. Which is um, an eerie kind of coincidence. Christ was born in 1875, died, died at the in, age of 75 in, in 1975. In 1975, yeah. And it was because he took 75 quaaludes. And, and he, he, it was at the Ford Theater and President Ford, say, the, yeah. he was driving a Ford. Yeah. The yeah. thing that was fucked up, too, and is I, it was a Ford Raptor, which hadn't been invented yet. Yeah. So it's we, possible... Which had been long extinct. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, and all this happened because he was talking about shutting down this, the central banks. A lot of creationists know? actually think that the Ford Raptor was put here by the devil to uh, trick us into believing yeah. that there were things before. Well, a humans. lot of creationists believe that the it was put here by God to test us, to test yes, our faith. faith. Yes, yes. like to yes. see the Ford Raptor and not get an erection. You know, that is a sign. It wasn't a trick kid. of Satan at all. So, we're playing um, Banjo Calzone. Have you, and you've never played this? I've never yes. played this. This was a game that I, it looked amazing when I was a kid, and I had a bunch of friends that had N64s. Mm-hmm. And I would go over on the pretense of of us hanging out, and instead they would just play this game and make me watch them for hours. It's good. Uh, it's Until one I of the best. I quietly left the room, and they didn't even fucking notice, but... Because they were too focused on a chicken yeah. and a bear, it's the, one of the best platformers for sure. No, it. So I've always wanted to play it, but I do have kind of a bitter spot about it. Okay, why? Is well, it because, has to do with rareware? No, it's because of. Because um, what he just Grant said. What are you yeah, talking the, the, the about? Oh, just because of <laughs> your you tra- just listening? because of your trauma. Grow up. Oh man, it's nowadays <laughs> trauma. You're so soft. You're soft. Um, so, okay, I get it. We can turn that around. It'll be fun. Okay. I mean, uh, ignore all the story. If there was a s- press the start button to skip, we would have skipped it. It's all about the. Uh, it's all about, all the, about the, the levels collect- and the music, really. The cl- yeah, it, it, it's a collectathon, right? Mm, yeah, sorta. We're not gonna be like hundred percenting it, but we're gonna collect enough things to, you know, advance. I I do love a good we'll do fine. Uh, Mario Odyssey was incredible. Um, one of my favorite games, probably a top three. It's it's it was so fun. That one became I tried to hundred percent that one, and then as you completed the game, what you thought was the you game, it became more. progressively overwhelming. Yeah. It's like here's a whole nother game on top of the game. Yeah. It's like oh I didn't I, sign I up. I met to... that same fate. I'm did on the you... like, darker side of the moon. Yeah. And I'm just like fuck this. Did you not pre- uh, complete it then? No, I did. I'm a hundred percent. Oh, I also, you were such a better I also man than me. Did 100% Mario Odyssey. Oh, I got woman. all 900 and whatever moons. Nine, nine, wow. Yeah. Odyssey is not the game I choose to do that on. Uh, is like Paper Mario? No, Mario 64, Mario Sunshine, those ones seem doable. Odyssey seems overwhelming. It, <laughs> it took, me, quite an endeavor. took yeah. me a long time to do it, but I did do it. Great game. Yes. I think it's the best Mario game. I believe so. No. I think it Maybe. Is. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I don't know. I used that. to say Super Mario World was the best Mario game. Mm. But now that Mario Maker exists and everyone's just making cool levels constantly. Mar- uh, Super Mario Bros. 3, though, is the best Mario game. Did I make game. you guys play my Mario Maker levels yet? I have a problem. I played your Mario le- Mario Maker levels for Mario Maker One. My leggies like don't a long time move. Ago. Yeah, like They're my leggies hell. don't They're move. They're so stupid. I they, can crouch they are in oops. everything, but leggies don't move. <laughs> my leggies. I'm don't sorry move. that we were we were talking Wait, over you. My right? legs don't move. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Help me! Stop laughing and help me! Hi. We had a problem right away, and then and then we fixed it. Mm-hmm. Um, Caleb's Caleb's leggies didn't work. My but now hopefully didn't. they do. We're playing uh, Banjo Calzone again. Um, we got fucking Dennis from Jurassic Park. Yep. Game's here. about a mole person and a girl. Your lives are in your hands and you got Butterfingers. She get a she get a kidnapped uh, by by a witch. And you're a mo- you're a monkey, and you have a duck, and you have to find her. Derek, Wait. that about sum it up. 
Yeah, I think you nailed that's it. That's a duck? That's not a duck. No, it's a it's chicken it's and a bear, and that's your sister Tootie, and she gets kidnapped by a green witch. Wait, was that... Was she a human? Uh, your sister? <laughs> yeah. That was clearly uh, some sort of uh, bear. Oh. So they're have a, you they're, been? They're a bio. Have you been thinking bears are humans this whole time? Yeah, that you've co- you've so gone ve- you've come very far in life. So, this, okay. thus far. I see her fur now. You do. All right, I understand. Okay, and the little dot nose, little Yogi Bear nose. Derek's puking. Yeah, Derek's puking in a, in a we're, trash We're just going to roll. We're going to roll we're right out. through it. We're not going to mention it. We're not going to bring it up. We're just going to keep on rolling. Yeah. No need reason to bring that up into the show. We'll just be silent about that one. I have a necrotic illness. Which one? One of the necrotic ones. I don't know. Um, <laughs> weren't we talking about Crocodile earlier or something from that? Yeah. So yeah, we're we're a pro-Crocodile show. Pro-CIA. pro cock. Crocock. Crocock. Hashtag Crocock. Yeah. You know what? I'm not going to. I'm not even going to try anymore. How about that, fellas? (laughs) Yeah, this is going to be a positive, affirming episode, I think. You think so? You getting good vibes from this one? No more specific death threats. We. I'm getting good vibes only. I'm telling you, what you did wasn't a death threat. Do your leggies work? Uh, Nothing works. I can't feel my face when I'm. (laughs) Press start. Okay. Son of a bitch! Hold on! Do all rare games, like, you can start the game by just going back into the main character's house? I think so, yes. I yeah. Think, I think in most rare games on the Nintendo 64, you can explore the home. Except, I don't... I don't Name think you... two. Banjo-Kazooie, DK64. DK64. Oh, asked and answered. Well, and the, the, the Donkey Kong Country games on SNES. You can just immediately go backwards into DK's house. Oh! Yeah, and see his, ba- see his banana his, hoard. His banana hoard. Yeah. Right next to my bed, I got this uh, picture of my his sister. Bongino Up on the hoard. wall, I got a picture of my sister. Ooh. Other side of the house, I got a picture of my yeah, who, sister who in my wallet. next to a giant picture of their sibling? And a little picture. That's very and scary, yeah. He really wants to save his sister. Most people crank it in bed. Mm-hmm. Do they There's not? There's a, a picture of his sister on the ceiling, like a mirror. <laughs> <laughs> oh, did God. you ever have ceiling posters? No. I did, uh, like, band posters. Did you ever have a poster like, on any wall system. that was worth it to, like, crank it to? Did I ever have crank-worthy posters? Yeah, do you have a sexy picture? What what poster would you put on the wall? In When I was in... Or on the ceiling, I mean. When I was in eighth grade, not in the ceiling, but on my wall... I had a, a poster that I got from one of those hit a poster with a dart, and you get to win that poster booths at Father Hennepin. Okay, like a carnival. And that's Father Hennepin for those who aren't colloquial carnival. listeners. It's a carnival that came through our town. I got uh, it at carnival, Father. It was a juggalo festival that would come through our town. Yes. And I won a poster there that was a woman in a plaid miniskirt. Who had straps over her shoulders that were just barely covering or her nipples, so you could see like all the titty meat but no nipple. Okay, but here's the, like the flaw in doing that is like, did your parents ever have anything to say about that? Absolutely not, because I don't think they wanted to address the issue with me. <laughs> and there was an issue to be addressed. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna roll with it, but I'm just gonna alert everyone. This is as high as I can jump. That's not good. Um. There's just one tap for A, but it's fine. I was gonna say, before we leave this the, this poster thing behind. Yeah, what do you got? Um, I had a poster I'll of, swim of, while you... of of Crank Two on my wall. Did you Crank Two that? I, no, I, Is that the one where he has to snort he has to be... drugs to stay alive because his he's been poisoned? Yeah. his heart rate like will go down. No, no crank, crank Two is high crank, voltage. Crank Two is uh where his heart has been replaced with a robot that needs to be electrocuted constantly or else it stops circulating blood. So the exact body. same thing yeah, happens to but him? but he has to keep shocking himself instead of... How does it? Ha- how does the same thing happen to him twice? Because it was a very well, strange thing that happened the first time. The poison destroyed his heart, or someone stole his heart. Uh-huh. Okay. At I the hate beginning, when that happens at the beginning of I'll let you have that as a given. Okay, continue. For some reason, instead of just letting him die, they put a robot heart in its place. Oh. And then he has to run around London just electrocuting his... Half-man, half-robot heart. Does the robot have a consciousness? No, it's just a robot It's heart. like Rob. <laughs> R-O-B, Rob. God, I wish I could have my heart replaced with Rob. Yeah. Just a spinning gyro in yeah. your chest. Yeah. That'd be beautiful. Maybe in the future, maybe. 
Yeah, that um, not, that joke didn't land as good as I thought it would, but... <laughs> the oh. high voltage joke? Yeah, the crank tube. <laughs> so that guy just said he has the capability to fix the bridge, but he's not going to do it till I learn all the moves. So, let's so he's a union man? Yeah. He's, the withhol book. he's withholding his yeah, labor? Yeah, book says I don't have to do this. <laughs> don't, I don't cross picket lines. And okay. the rest. This, this mole is a scab. You can tell that... Like, whenever the teachers <laughs> strike, he goes in to be a sub. Yeah. And he pushes in that fucking cart, and he lets the kids watch Homeward Bound. <laughs> the TV on the cart. While he meekly looks through his Tinder. Yeah. All he's, new yeah, matches he's, yet. He's, he's swiping on everything on Twinder, but no one's biting. Twinder. <laughs> Twinder. You idiot, you idiot. Twinder. <laughs> so... You need to learn the moves before the union man will, will fix the bridge? Yeah, he said I could fix it, but I'm not going to fix it for the likes of you. You don't know enough moves and the rest. Yeah, I've never killed a, a man. You don't know what it feels like. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you haven't seen the light drain from a man's seen the eyes. world yet. With your hands around his neck. You haven't seen that? You yeah, you've felt that? You've never popped a man's eyeballs like grapes with your thumbs? You've never tasted the warm blood? You've never seen the steam rise out of his body as if the soul itself was leaving. So what move are you learning here? Kid? I'm learning the beak bash. I'm going to become my own little union Homie buster can break here. rocks with his... Homie beak. can go like this. Oh my god. All my homies can go like this. <laughs> Do you ever just wear <laughs> your friend in a backpack, your smaller... More submissive friend. My diminutive friend. Yeah, yeah. And, backpack. Then, and then... Oh, I have an extra honeycomb piece. Quite sure it's a lot of crazy energy ball. You know when so they sound like when you do that <laughs> incredible um, voice, I can't help but think of the baby from the dinosaur show. You know, the you know? baby come oh, from me. dinosaurs, yeah. the titular dinosaur show. Yeah. I love that the last episode of that show is them huddling in their living room preparing for death. Yeah, <laughs> that is how that. Ended. They all deserved it. <laughs> they really did too. I'm Those glad. filthy bastards. I'm glad that they they're thought dead. they were an intelligent life form. Well, you know what? Smarts don't stop a meteor. You fuck face yeah. dinosaurs. Yeah, they... they're so smug. That's what I don't like about dinosaurs. Especially the uh, the dad. He Holy was a smug shit, piece was he smug? He was, uh, he was, and w unduly so. What did he do? What was his profession? He was like a contractor or something. Dude, he can contract these nuts for a sucking. <laughs> Fuck him. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember any characteristics of anyone's personality. I remember the, uh, just the baby being an obnoxious piece yeah, of shit. Yes. The baby would pound on his little high chair and mm -hmm. demand fresh blood or something. I don't remember, but anyways, I watched a life-changing movie recently. Yeah, you were talking about this earlier. Was it a Lifetime away. movie? Um, no. Okay, what was the movie? I'm it done guessing. It was called Skinamarink. Skinamarink. Oh. Skinamarink. Skinamarinky okay. Hank, Skinamarinky do. That, it, yes. The, what, the, the, the song that, what that was you just it about? This, okay, I have never seen a movie like this in my life. It was, it was incredibly pretentious. It was, <laughs> it was too long. But at the same time, it scared me in a way I have not been scared by a movie since it was I was a, like a child. A, the genre of horror? Yes. Horror? It is like a rough synopsis is uh, these two kids are these two siblings are sleeping at night and then they wake up in the middle of the night and their parents are gone and all the doors and windows in their house are also gone. Oh, spooky! And they are trapped in this home. No, they're not. The windows are gone. It's perfect. They have so many holes <laughs> they have to get out of. But go, well, go on. All the all the all the holes. <laughs> they have no doors. <laughs> all they the have pores. never been less trapped in this house. <laughs> but go on. <laughs> no, I meant like like. Like, the wall, like, there are just walls where doors and windows used oh, to be. Oh, they're trapped in this house. Yes, yes. That's, that, okay. I could have been more clear about that. I, it, yeah. I could have, I could have just believed you. I don't know. They woke yeah. up in a panic. Someone took our windows. <laughs> our doors. Our doors. We're trapped. Those were Anderson windows. Those are 250 a four square. Jesus Put fucking up. Christ. Double hungs, no less. <laughs> yeah, there are just walls. Where the windows and doors used okay. to be. Okay. And the how does it end? Skip right to the end. No, wait, don't tell me. All I, right, I don't tell him. No, I can't even describe to you how this fucking movie ends. I. What country I, was this film from? It's an American. It is film. okay. Yeah, yeah. Usually, good horror movies nowadays are, foreign, are yeah. not American. But this is American. Yeah. yeah. Um. It. <laughs> God damn it! Ah, just fucking shatter your what tailbone. Yeah, what on a that. rough neck landing they give you. Yeah, and, th and then eventually this, this disembodied voice starts talking to the children and giving them bizarre commands. What are the and commands? And it is just a, a fucking terrifying movie. I was, my wife fell asleep. We were watching it together. What's and it on? 
So we'll we'll get to that. Or well, yeah, what we'll streaming service is it on? We'll get quick. to that. You can um, do the plugs okay. at the end. Okay. Well, okay, it's not technically out yet. I may have watched it. Oh, hold oh. it to jump higher. They yeah, make it, you learn a yeah. whole Netflix. jump. Netflix. Okay, cool. Yeah, Netflix. Yeah, on, yeah. yeah. On. It's on uh, HBO Minimum. You need a VPN. Yeah. Go um, on. It will be coming out soon, though. Okay. In like early 2023, we'll get uh, and I will go see it with you guys at like the lagoon or something. Okay. But weirdest cinematography I've ever seen. Ever seen like half the fucking movie is just the camera like laying sideways on the floor. So you, you got see, like Resident Evil one angles. Yes, and you see like people's legs walking down a hallway, and you hear them talking. I don't think there's like a single direct shot of a human being in this entire film. Like, oftentimes the camera's just pointed at like the wall or a TV and you just hear things happening off camera it is it is so strange. sounds like you saw a bad movie no yeah, that's look so <laughs> it sounds like you saw a broken it, movie and it's and it's shot with like super 8 and everything is so super dark and grainy and it it just looks like a cursed fucking movie it I understand why it looks the like alluring. the house itself is a character somehow. I, you know? I, I that really you. intrigues me. That I, yeah, that sentence was weird. Because it sounds like it's almost like uh, the it, it seems like they're taking advantage of the new. Um, I don't even know if it's a new terminology, but it's new to me. This like whole liminal space. Crazy. Oh yes. yes, the back it room. It is yes. It is, it has huge back rooms, spot vibes, huge lim- liminal space horror. Yes, I'm into is. that. I'm into that. It is, yes, me too. It, it's very. It it is too long. It's super pretentious. But like at one point, like I was just gripping my knees to my chest and my heart was fucking pounding watching this movie alone. There is a movie it, that sounds similar to the the little bit that you've given about this of like a voice starting to talk to them. Mm-hmm. Um, I fucking don't remember what it's called. And it was a very low budget, not that great of a movie. Uh like british i was either british or new zealand movie uh lord of the one rings. of those not great yeah one of those chase. shitty fucking new zealand movies like lord of the ring um <laughs> <laughs> low budget fucking pieces of garbage yeah lord of the rings. Well, that schlock that they shit out in those sheep fucker towns look out uh, for me i'm an oscar anyways <laughs> hey you best direct the banjo <laughs> but uh for his movie skin of a rinky skin of a rinky do i love is that song in the movie? Uh, I think so. Better okay, be. I think it is. Yes. Anyways, a lot um, of old cartoons in the movie. There is uh, a movie though where yeah, either British or New Zealand, they all get locked in their houses and it's like a lockdown, and then the television comes on and starts talking to people and telling them what to do and saying that there's been like a some some kind of like terrorist attack of like neurotoxins, and so everyone needs to stay inside their houses and they've. They're I, they're using these big metal cage things to like seal everyone inside of their houses. I have and they're seen like, this don't movie. leave. You need to listen to the like what yeah. what happens on the TV. Listen to the television. What's it say? Yeah. It's telling them like we're gonna drop like a fucking <laughs> down your chimney and you gotta take yes. it. You oh, all have to like I've, inject it. I've shit. seen this movie. Is the it's twist not that it's amazing? Is the, yeah. is the but, twist that it's only happening to one house? That would be um, cool. I don't remember. No, the, oh. the twist was um, that we're all cucks that listen to our computers. And yeah, yeah. And we, and we, exactly. We do it. We we would. Kill our oh, children. you take the <laughs> just because they shoved it down your chimney, yeah. man. Yeah. yeah, Like you'd eat anything that rolled down your chimney, you little hog boy. Yeah, yeah. That was just yeah. <laughs> slurp it up, piggy. Yeah. Wee, yeah. suey, <laughs> you fucking gonna pig. slap your belly red. <laughs> Come here, little boy. So yeah. she does a, a fly machine, a Jeff Goldblum with this uh, little with your sister to get oh, sexy. Oh no! To get what? To get, uh, to get sexy. sexy. Yeah. It is the oh, plot of the game. Okay. She's trying to I make herself like, younger I, and I thought I misheard you. Younger and more you, tight you by sexy. mixing okay. her body with that of uh, Jeff Goldblum. I, yeah. I I don't like the. You know what? I'm not gonna say why I don't like that. I think it speaks for itself, and, <laughs> yeah. and that's all. 